I am Deacon Michael Kassar, and I will be ordained a priest this Saturday. I mean, most people think it's interesting, it's relevant that I converted to Catholicism uh, in college. So a little more than 10 years ago, I entered the church. And so obviously growing up, the priesthood wasn't on the radar, uh, not something I thought about. I wouldn't have dreamed about it or anything like that. So it came up later in some sense a smaller time frame, but it feels very gradual to me, the call, you know? First I entered the church and then, you know, I thought I was doing well. I made my days of obligation. I went to confession. But then I met people uh, when I was at Northern Illinois. I studied um, in Northern Illinois for a while and they were my age and they went to daily mass and they uh, prayed in front of the Eucharist. And so I wanted to do that. I'm Catholic, you know, and I believe it. I'm committed. So I started doing that with them and so going to daily mass and uh, getting more involved with the student center there. And uh, just slowly my life kind of started centering more and more around the church, the life of the church. Uh, the people I talked to that, that I enjoyed were Catholic. Um, and so when it was time for me to think, I, I got my degree, I got a, a master's degree from, from there. And I'm like, okay, what, what am I going to do with, with this? Either I have to keep studying, which I'm getting kind of tired of, or it's got to be something else. So what is that something else? And so just in my mind, I just kept thinking, you know, first it was very vague and uh, like, well, theoretically, I could become a priest but it, it didn't seem real or plausible. But then it would just keep coming back to me, the thought, well, I could become a priest. And clearer and less silly each time. And so eventually, you know, I was just nagging at me. I contacted a priest out there in Northern Illinois and I talked to him about it. And he started giving me like helpful, practical things to do to kind of actually discern actively. You know, and so when I think about being a priest, what, what am I, you know? It's, it's the mysteries that are happening around me. And so when I think about forgiving sins, uh, elevating the, it's like, just, I just don't want to mess it up. It's really, really humbling. And, uh, you know, that he wants to work through me. Um, but, you know, I, what am I in, <laughs> in the midst of everything?